My name is uh, Aurélie Gonin. I'm based in the French Alps. And I would say that I do a lot of things around motion image because I would say my main occupation is being a director for videos with a specialty in sports, especially mountain sports. I've been shooting with Nikon for a very long time because that's how I came to taking pictures because I was borrowing my father FM2 but then I moved more to videos and I have to say that I kind of lost the passion for image because at this era it was looking very like new style and I got a Nikon D90 which was the first DSLR which was able to record videos and with this camera, my patient came back because what I was filming was looking more a movie than news with uh, like the short depth of field and the colors which I always like with Nikon cameras. And uh, then I really was super interested in the Z-series because for me the Z-series is better for video than uh, the DSLR because the mirrorless really help for shooting video, I would say now. With the Z9 and the DFC, I think I have the perfect combo for what I'm doing. I became an Icon ambassador to try it before it was released. So the first thing I did was going into the menu and look at the settings for video and I'm like, wow, that's amazing. I've been shooting on uh, some huge snowstorm and the camera was super wet. But the camera never had any failure, even in the very, very cold environment. The frame rate and the speed, like being able to shoot 4K at 120 frames per second is something amazing. Yeah, when I film in the snow, of course, it's super bright environment, so I need to manage that. Because I have a 10 bit H265, it allows me to have a big range of exposures in my shots. Some people say that for video, you have always to have your speed twice as your frame rate. And I don't really allow with that because I don't see any problem with going way higher because I think your image is more sharp. Something I really like with the Z9 is that the autofocus is amazing and the camera is faster and better than I am in uh, doing the focus. So I want to be discreet, like I just take what happens in front of my camera. And for that, if I can be ready to shoot instantly, I get all these precious moments that otherwise I would never have. So it's all these uh, things that for me make it the best camera on the market. I have to say zoom, for me it's way easier to bring uh, one zoom than bringing uh, five lenses. I really like the low angle and I really like the low angle shot with the backlight. I have to say ergonomic for sure because what matters is how you hold it. Now nah, definitely more than gear. I think it's way easier now with the new tools. I love photography for pleasure, but for a job, I'm mainly a videographer. Uh, definitely shooting outdoors. I don't mind being in a studio sometimes, you know, it's comfortable, it's warm. I never use a tripod. I really like to have my camera always accessible and uh, shooting with my hand. Uh, it's always hard to get up in the morning, but I think there's nothing better than a, a sunrise. I'm in the daylight because uh, I shoot outside and maybe during the day, so yeah, daylight. If you're pretty sure about your settings, why not doing a GPEG? Because like, you don't have to redo it in post-production. I would be more 4K 120 because a super slow motion on a great sport action is something that looks very, very cool. No selfies, it's way too much. Oh, beer, a good IPA, for sure.